Designers emphasized wearability and ease, delivering platforms, block heels, not to mention a selection of flats dressed up with fringe and embellishment. So you don't have to feel guilty about not wearing heels. The spring 2015 runways gave us a whole new crop of kicks to covet for this season. So what exactly do we have to look forward to? Joining us now to talk shoes is our fashion expert and blogger of MoreThanTurquoise.com, Jamie Lewinger. Thanks for joining us. Hi, guys. Jamie, good to see you. Yeah. Nice to see Friday. both of you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. All right, so this is always, to me, this is always the interesting things. You see all these things on the runways, mm -hmm. but how they transition onto the shelves. So what do That's you got right. for us? Well, I'll tell you what. We have been talking about these trends for about four or five months now. <laughs> Uh -huh. But they are now here, right in front of us. So we've given you ample warning, and your foot should be ready. <laughs> <laughs> your foot should be ready for these trends yes. at this point. So okay. I thought I'd start with my shoes. Okay. The trend of French. I love that. French. Whoa, Whoa! Look at those. Look at how cool those so are. So I know that not everybody uh, can rock the French shoe. So I acknowledge oh. this. This is a serious shoe, and I've you can tell I've kept the rest of my outfit. Pretty neutral. Okay. But I have brought some images of some other fringe options, and you know, fringe is not going away. It's mm -hmm. been around mm -hmm. for a while. It's right. still here, and we're going to see it in fall and winter as well. Now, open toe booty fringe totally rocks. Mm -hmm. Got a sandal with fringe with an ankle ankle strap fringe. So those fringe are going to kind of drape over your over your foot. But, yeah. Kind of like, like okay. what I've got going. Yeah. Like what, okay. Yes. Okay. And then a, a mule on a slide, which we'll talk about mules and slides here in just a moment. But those are just some examples of fringe, mm -hmm. and um, you know, if you're gonna try it out for the first time, try a sandal. You know, give it a mm -hmm. shot and see. I mean, this moves when you walk, so you want to. <laughs> you, know, you have to see if, if it works for you or not. Okay. I like it. Yeah. Um, so you said one thing really quick before we move on, Jamie. That you said you, you kept the rest of your wardrobe pretty minimal. Right. Because if you do too much, it's too much. You're gonna end up looking <laughs> like Snuffleupagus from Sesame Street. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely, right, Chad. Okay. I hadn't thought of that, yeah. but yeah. So so you don't want the snuffle up against things. I don't on, have guys. that look. All right, so uh, <laughs> platform is. Uh, let's talk a little bit about the platform mm -hmm. shoes. First okay. of all, I'm always in awe okay. of how you ladies can do it. Yeah. Well, so do you know what makes a platform a platform? Mm. Okay, so a platform has a thicker sole. That's, and I brought some examples. So mm -hmm. not only is it thick in the back, it's thick in the front. Mm -hmm. So that is what a plat, that's how a platform is defined. And you okay. know, they're not hard to walk in. You know, performers use them. They're, uh, Elton John is a big fan of platform uh -huh. shoes. And so um, they do give you height. But they're very, I mean, the, it balances out because of the thickness in the front as mm -hmm. well. And so we were just looking at black and white is super strong. The white heel is huge right now, that big, thick white heel, mm -hmm. raffia print, uh, raffia soles, and uh, a fun print like that banana print that I just mm -hmm. showed. <laughs> okay. I like them, though, because I feel like my foot's not as steep in the foot. So for the platform, like you were saying, when it's a little bit higher up in the top, in It the balances front, it out. Yeah. It and, does. And like you were saying, it's not as hard to uh, walk in. It's not. Okay. Like Surprisingly it. not. You have yeah. to try a pair sometimes. Mm -hmm. well, <laughs> Just put them on and try them out. <laughs> why not? Why not? <laughs> All right, so the, here's here's a new phrase that I'm not familiar with. Platforms? Platforms. Is that right? So what's that? It's a but okay, so a platform I'm is a platform mm -hmm. that is flat. So I brought so some the whole, images. See, gotcha. the okay. sole is thicker as well, but it's basically flat or has a very slight angle in the back. That is hot right now. This is a very hot shoe. The flat form. They're uh -huh. comfy. You know, they have a little bit of an orthopedic type look, oh. but people are digging that right now. Really? And so, yeah, okay. it's a trend, um, yeah. but that's one of the hot shoes that's going on at the moment. Wow. That's yep. crazy. Are these, are these coming back? Were they big in the 90s? Platform or? is kind of okay. new. Platform has yes. been around. Fringe has been around, but uh -huh. platform is kind of a new. Platform is a new yes. thing. Yes. Okay. Now, uh, so you, you said earlier you're going to be talking about uh, a mule. You're going to talk about it a little mm. bit later on. Right. So well, let's talk about that mules and slides. What's okay. a, again? I know. Okay, <laughs> I'm here to help. So <laughs> mules, clogs, and slides. Mm -hmm. They're they have one thing in common. That is that they don't have anything in the back of their shoe. Mm -hmm. I did bring an image, and I'm not sure if we're going to show it. But there's no strap, so you're okay. sliding your foot in. Mules and clogs are almost one of the same. Mules are dressier than clogs, okay. generally, okay. and there they are. And, and, and clogs and mules have closed toes. Slides mm. have open toes. So that's the only difference between the two. So if okay. you look at the left, that's a slide. Mm -hmm. Okay. Color blocking's big right now. Then we've got pointy toe mule, because mm -hmm. it's dressier. 
black and white, big time. And then, you know, on the far right, just that's a slide with some crystal embellishments, which is also a strong trend right now. Those are, I, I just, I look at these and I'm like, those have got to be so difficult to wear. They're I not. like them. No? Yeah, that, to me, they're <laughs> comfy. I have Plus a pair. Kick them yeah. Off and, yeah, you exactly. See, that's, I, that's what I would do, but not, I'd like, on accident. I'd like, <laughs> <Just> <laughs> <walking> <laughs> <and> like <laughs> I'd have to put leashes on them to pull them back on. <laughs> okay. All right, so speaking of leashes, let's go, let's go back a little bit and let's talk about lace. Mm -hmm. Lace shoes. Okay. That's, that's that's what I'm talking about. Okay, it's Friday. So <laughs> lace shoes, uh, lace ups are big right now as mm. well. And the reason you want to wear a lace up, you want it to show. Mm -hmm. So you okay. you want you don't want to cover it up with a pair of pants or a long skirt. So you want to show it lacing up your leg. Um, so what's strong right now is the dress or your lace shoe on the left. Um, pointy flat shoes are huge right now and that lace up would look cute with shorts or a sundress and then on the far right the gladiator lace up is that still happening i mean some of these lace ups go all the way up to the knee so wow. you know it's just what your comfort yeah. level is in wearing huh. and there's only one other trend left yeah mm -hmm. and that's the power platform mm -hmm. the power platform and okay. Christian, <laughs> yeah i know you like stop plat platform excuse me power pump power pump mm -hmm. okay. so um pumps you know typically are black or taupe or whatever, but the power pump is something, Christian, that you would wear that you will rock, that you feel comfortable and, mm. and you are confident in it. So it's a hot pink or strong black and white graphic or the middle pump, which is a Valentino rock stud. Uh, that's huge right now at the moment with the studs mm -hmm. and the rainbow pattern. So those are just strong pumps that make you feel good when you wear them. Mm -hmm. I like the power pump. So out of all of these, Kristen, what are you going oh, with? Oh, rainbow, for sure. Rainbow. The ones with the studs, that would just show. I would love, like, black dress and those. And yeah. I'd be a happy You'd girl. You feel powerful. Yeah, yeah, exactly. All right, well, <laughs> well speaking of uh, the power pumps, I know there's a big show we had talked about uh, a while back coming to the Albuquerque Museum. I just want to hit on it again. Killer Heels. Killer Heels. Opens May 31st, is that End right? End of this month, yes. I okay. believe it's the, either the 30th or the 31st. 30th it runs all the way till the beginning of September. Okay, and that's something that you really recommend people getting yes. out. Yes. Because I mean, we're always talking about the shoes, and the, mm -hmm. but there, there really is an art form to these. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, yeah, fantastic. Absolutely. All right, well, get out, see Jamie at Killer yes. Heels. If you want more information on power pumps, platforms, or if you just need a recap like this guy right here, <laughs> head over to Casa.com.